I have one shirt lad here. Do you keep missing your grenades? Are all your cannon rounds constantly off target? Surprisingly enough, you can rest easy knowing that this is not due to any lack of accuracy on your part or due to some issues within the game. You see, most throwables in Get Em Assault Survive use direction inputs to adjust their trajectory. Just like the sniper rifle type weapons in this game series, which let you adjust the aim offset manually, the aim offset for cannons and the grenades is likewise governed by the aforementioned direction inputs. So here's how you use them. By inputting the forward direction, your cannon shots and grenade tosses will arc sharply upwards, pretty much letting you do the whole indirect fire thing. You'd counter against the obstacles. Might not be optimal for closer or faster moving targets. If you don't press any direction on the d-pad as you fire, your projectile is going to arc normally, letting you hit mid-range targets while keeping a degree of verticality in its trajectory. The left and right direction inputs use the same trajectory type, albeit with a slight sideways offset. Now, by inputting the backwards direction, you can get the most direct throw slash cannon shot angle of them all. If you have a clear line of sight on something, you can and will likely hit it when using this input. The tracking ability of projectiles originated via the backward input is absolutely insane, so when in doubt, just direct fire and you're good. Obviously, you may run into problems with the toss slash cannon shot height not being sufficient to hit past a certain level of incline, but it's still a solid foolproof option. Besides, if you really can't hit stuff directly, arced throws are still at your disposal. Here's the thing alright. This is pretty much the long and short of how those two weapons that work. However, that still leaves some petty trivia I stumbled upon while labbing. If you watched any videos covering the Hadolfer in this game, you probably know of the drive-by cannon fire in the tank mode, though staying on the topic of tanks, all units that move on treads will not be stopped by firing as they go forward or backward. Just like the tank types, hovering units like the Zamel and the Madrock can input the backwards direction while going sideways as they fire in order to keep moving while firing the cannon directly ahead of you. Just felt like covering it, since the game doesn't tell you this, at least not in English, but I recall the original JP Guide page should be in the game's how-to section. It's a short one since I've got a fair amount of things on my plate at the moment, but regardless, I hope it came in handy. Feel free to like, comment and subscribe, and until next time, Shirtlade, signing out.